Okay. What do you understand by adverbs? How the actions are done. Okay. And? And? The expression of... It is kind of adjective only. It is giving details about now. More detail about now. More detail about verbs. Verbs. Yes, adverbs. They give details about verbs. Verbs, verbs. Yes, it, um, like uh, adjective is det uh, giving details about now. It is giving details about verb. How? How the action is done? When the action was done? Where? How much? To what extent? Why? All these things, anything about the action which has happened, where it has happened, when it has happened, how it has happened, uh, how many times it has happened, to what extent it has happened. Okay, so it's adverb of frequency, adverb of manner, adverb of time, adverb of place. But right now at this stage, we are only discussing simple adverb of manner. And this is how. Okay, so who can narrate the story? Who can... Uh, have you gone through the story? Yes, yes. Yes. So you have to assume yes, yourself as the teacher of the class and everyone here is the student who will try. Can I try? Who is that? Neha? Yeah. Yes. Please, go ahead. Okay. Hello, kids. You know, today I'll tell you a story about three different animals. They are different and similarly they have different movements. So... Uh, there was one uh, one uh, squ squirrel named Luna, and it was very fast. It 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 was the fastest in the uh, in the jungle. But uh, they had to do uh, they had to collect food for themselves. So they she found her friends turtle and rabbit. They were very, uh, but the turtle was but she found that the turtle was very slow and the rabbit was very energetic. So she thought, what to do next? But she had to gather food, right? Everybody needs food to eat. So they were very hungry. They wanted, they all wanted to eat food. So they made a plan and they said, we will collectively go and collect a lot of nuts for themselves. So they gradually started. So the squirrel uh, uh, ran swiftly. The uh, turtle was uh, moving very carefully and cautiously. And the rabbit jumped really happily. But... They all collected their share of food, right? Sabne apna food le liya. And they were all, uh, they had a lot of food with themselves. So everybody was very happy. So, you know what? Luna noticed that although, although they had uh, different ways of moving, but they all did their task very well because they were very hungry. So now you got it? What I'm trying to tell you about the story that we we can do one task but in a way in different it can be in a different manner okay very good very good okay who can do the rhyme i'll sing one uh, wait 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 uh, everybody has to get something uh, to beat the music okay anything with the rhyme, we will uh, beat some any rhythm, like you can tap or you can clap or you can take two spoons, anything in your hand or whatever you have to make the noise. So, uh, who is going to tell the rhyme? Yes, ma'am. So, we have to uh, get, add the music also. Okay? Yes. So, go yes. and get something, everyone. You can just have some shaker if you have any uh, container uh, containing something. Yes. Okay. Sunita so has a backers. Okay. Shall I start now? Yeah. Adverbs, adverbs tell us how, how we do your thing. Slowly, quickly, happily, they make our words sing. Adverbs, adverbs tell us how, how we do the thing. Slowly, quickly, happily, they make our words sing. Loudly, softly too, they tell us what to do. 
Artworks help us every day. How you know it's true? Okay, well done. Who will do next? Next, who will be doing? So here, this uh, okay. I'll try, but uh, where the poem star, the rhyme starts from. They are words that tell us how, and adverb is the name who, right, ma'am? Hmm. Okay, let me see. Try that. It's a little difficult. Adverbs. Adverbs are the words that tell us an adverb is the name. Adverbs are the name. They tell us adverb is the name. The adverbs are the name that tell us verb. Adverbs are the name. Uh, then loudly, softly, slowly too. Quickly, quietly, that's what they do. Oh, adverbs are the name. They tell us the word. The, and the letter is a o a adverbs are the words they tell us r is the letter o adverbs are the letter adverbs are the words that tell us b is the letter o a d w a d r b adverb adverbs are the names o okay so uh, you have to Add music, you can have your drums with you, anything, shakers, drums, anything, okay? Now, how can you connect verb and adverb together? The verb is an action word. The adverb describes uh, the verb. He jumped, he jumped highly. Yes. So one person can do the verb and another can uh, do it in various ways. Okay. Like for example, uh, one person has come and he will just do like this. So what is this? Run. Run. Walk or Walk. run. Walk or run. Okay. Now you can have three different students and you tell them to walk at three different speeds. Hmm. Somebody will do very slowly. slowly. Somebody will do very fast. Awesome. They will just do it like this. So that will, the action which is done in how many different ways. So that way, uh, any task you can give, comb your hair in different uh, speed. So you are very slowly combing. You are combing fast. Okay. Eating very slowly, then normal, then very fast. So this is going to give the clarity that this is adverb slowly fast okay now have you gone through the games which i have shared which game yes, you can mom. yes so who can tell any one game maybe from that chat group or maybe your own idea there is adverb simon says so like we'll say how to perform an action so simon says sit Slowly. Simon says, clap fast. Simon says, uh, anything. Turn around quickly. So like we have to tell them how, how they have to perform that action. Okay, good. Yes. Any other idea? Anybody has? What more we can do as an activity for adverbs? Uh, we can uh, like uh, we can uh, name a, uh, like if there is a class and we can name the students and we can say like uh, uh, Vandana dance fast and Ravi uh, clap angrily, uh, Ria uh, shout loud. So that way we can uh, point out kids and do uh, ask them specifically to do do that particular uh, like adverb as uh, that thing. Okay. Yes. What else? 
Now, as a team, as a group, all of us, everybody will do this activity. Now, everybody clap loudly. Put your hands together, clap loudly. Softly, softly, softly. Yeah, so like this, two, three adverbs we can keep and make them do the action. Now, stand up, stamp, 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 stamp. Next time, stamp, stamp, stamp. Stamp, stamp, stamp. So all these physical activities will well will make the child more interesting. Then sleep because these are all they will they, they do very harsh. So this will make them disciplined also, behavioral wise also. And these words are very catchy to do with actions. Yes. So you have to bring the clarity of having the activity done as an adverb and not as a verb. Okay. The same activity what you are doing should have something where you can tell that this is adverb and not we are not doing we are just practicing verbs again but the new thing which we are introducing is an adverb yeah i think practice i yes, yes. thank you anybody else has any idea any game uh, ma'am uh, there is uh, this kind of dumpsters and relays race i already explained it yesterday about uh adjective same way we can play with the adverb also and there is one more game which is a kind of treasure hunt so for, uh, as a treasure and the same way uh, we can make a chits uh, of different different adverb and uh, if they will pick up any chit like slowly so uh, either they have to do they have to add the any verb to that word and uh, they have to do that action or if uh, something is like uh, slowly so they can bring out notebook and they can write slowly kind of action they can walk slowly kind of action so we just have to tell them that bring out the um, kids and read the word and add any ad um, any verb with that and do the action accordingly that way like walk slowly uh sneathering so like they can sneather on the floor that way so that that kind of thing we can be uh, practicing with them yeah ma'am uh, uh, also the uh, we can tell the kids to uh, give uh, uh, such adverbs to their friends or the uh, fellows like uh, we can uh, the, uh, like ravi can tell to uh, uh, rita that you know you have to cl uh, clap fast so they even they have to for the, their own uh, uh, expansion of adverb uh, like explanation of their own what they are thinking about the adverbs what they have understood till now so they have the uh, uh, they can give the uh, task to their own classmates i mean that will expand their own uh, uh, this vocabulary also and understanding of 